Guys, this week we're cooking a picanha and we're doing our first in-person episode with Matt J, my co-founder at ProctorU and the managing director at Techstars Alabama. Let's get five quick minutes with Matt J. So Techstars Alabama, um, you you left uh, Measure Learning, ProctorU a couple years ago and um, kind of bounced around and did a bunch of things and ended up at Techstars. So, so tell us how you got there. Yeah. So, you know, when we had that great exit in 2020, I the just great felt- exit. Is that what we're going to call it? The, the great the exit. The great exit. Yes. <laughs> Amongst a lot of things that happened, the great yeah. exit. Um, but when that happened, I really felt the need to give back. Um, as you know, we were both just so focused on executing, growing the business, yeah. and just dealing with everything that was going on. There was so much of the Birmingham startup ecosystem that was happening like all around. And I just was like, man, I really, I really didn't give anything to that, quite honestly. And I felt, I felt bad. And I was like, I really want to take some time out and help some folks. There, there's multiple tech stars. It's in, it's in multiple yes. cities. And, and I've never, I don't think I've fully understood how they all are interconnected. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Yes. So like if, if tech stars Atlanta has like a big exit, does that do anything to tech stars in Alabama or is everybody kind of on their own island? It does. So. First off, Techstars is the largest pre-seed, early stage investment, like venture capitalist company in the really? world. It is. Really? It is the largest one. So it's looked at as like a venture capital firm. It is a way. venture capital firm. Oh, it is a venture capital okay. firm. Okay. Now that's starting to make sense. And so we operate in 14 different countries. We have 41 different cities and we have over 60 programs like all over the world. So Birmingham, sixty different. So it's in sixty different cities. Well, it's it's some cities have multiple programs. So, like for example, oh, wow. you're talking about about Atlanta. They have two different programs through two different sponsors. They have one that is by the city that is uh, like a, a social impact type focus, and they have another one by their sponsor, Cox Communications. And so here in Birmingham, okay. we are Alabama Energy Tech Accelerator, and our sponsor is Alabama Power Southern Company. And so they help define our thesis and our focus. So I'm looking for 12 of the best and brightest energy tech, climate tech, sustainability, and customer experience companies. And I bring them to Birmingham mm. for, for, for 13 weeks. Um, they come from all over the world. And so for that first month, we give them mentors. We call it mentor madness. And it's a lot, it's a lot of mentors. So they get about anywhere between six to 10 mentors that they what? work with. Six to 10 mentors. It's How does lot. that work? It's a lot. So we'll, we'll go into that. So six to 10 <laughs> mentors and then they get programming. So what we do ahead of time is we talk to them. We go through this kind of like, like process, right? Where we talk to the companies, we talk to the founders and we find out what they need and we try to tailor right. their, their experience to what they need so that they get the most bang for their buck. So what's what's next for Techstars? Like you've you've got you've got a couple of good companies in there, I think, right? Yeah. And so you got you got anybody you're you're really high on? Anybody you think's got a chance? Oh yeah, I've got um right now we've got like I'm supposed to have top twenty four, and then I narrow it down to twelve with a with a selection committee. Yeah. But I've got like thirty really really promising people, so I'm trying to like work through the thirty to oh maybe I edge this one out and you know, but it's 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 tough, man. The, the quality of applicants that comes through Techstars. And uh, you hear a lot of these challenges from other venture capitalists about sourcing. Man, it's because it's the power of the brand. Like Techstars mm. is just so big, like everybody just goes to Techstars. And these, and these people are coming in from, everywhere. not from Alabama, like from all over, right? All Everywhere. So Techstars gets applicants from all over the world, but just talking about Techstars growth. So we make over 500 investments annually Whoa. And we're, we're, we're some, some years we're pushing a thousand. We're the most active. We're the largest, like I said, the largest, we just beat out our closest competitor, which is Y Combinator. I was about to ask yeah. how this ranked to Y, so, yeah, y Combinator we, still a thing. Oh yeah. Cause all I ever hear is tech stars. It's neck and neck. It's neck and neck. Interesting. So the difference between like, if you talk about products and, and positioning different, the key differentiator, Y Combinator believes that you have to go back to the Mecca Silicon Valley in order to be ah. successful. Screw that! But tech stars, I can, I can, I can go ahead and go on record and go through <laughs> that. And you can see, right? So tech stars believes that you can create a Silicon Valley in any community. Mm -hmm. It's all about community ecosystem 
and being able to do this. And so that's why we're growing so fast. Guys, if you enjoyed that five quick minutes with Matt J, the entire episode is available in the next episode in the podcast. We'll dive into the picanha more, talk about the meat, talk about the whiskey and all of our thoughts on the social media, Silicon Valley and everything else. So check out the full episode if you enjoyed this one.